Okay, if you're going to make your own website, one of the first things you're going to want to do is create a design document. What the design document is, is just basically a, a written description of everything the site is, does, and, and everything about the site. Uh, some of the usefulness of this is it forces you to, to go through the thought process of planning out the site. Uh, and also to organize things into a, a logical manner and uh, as you see here I have up on the screen the, the outline of the design document for uh, my site and uh, we, in the content section you actually will have an outline of you know basically how this site will be structured um, when you fill in the body of this document you can even write the uh, text of the design document as if you're actually writing the text that's on the site itself so it'll help you um, so as you can see here I have a summary and if, if we we looked at that summary it'd be a, what would be written on the main page of my site and uh, some, of the, some of the other sections here you have uh, the content and this is at least at this point in time this is what I'm planning on putting on the site the content uh, we're going to have, uh, uh, let me step back one, one second here and just look at the summary. And so you can see I've started to write out the summary and I, I kind of wrote this as, as if this is going to be on the main page of the site. And then you get down into the content and uh, it, it fills in some of the blanks there. So we're, it's a better view than outline view. Um, so uh, we're going to have a, a series of videos and, and, and text-based tutorials on website development and here's some of the, the subsets of those. Uh, we're also going to do some uh, tutorials and on uh, game development and some of the pieces that go along with that. Uh, also so I have a, a bit of a technical background and we'll put in uh, some, some sections on some basic engineering uh, type stuff and also some computer science type topics uh, both hardware and software uh, and much most of the time I and on this particular site I do plan on uh, generating a little bit of uh, passive income with this and so the site that I'm going to be working on here uh, there's going to be a few ways of ge generating some revenue. One is going to be through PPC advertising. That's uh, pay per click. Um, so you've, you've everybody's seen websites that have banner ads, and when you click on those banner ads, the person who owns that site, you know, most of the time they get paid for that. And so you'll see the same thing on this site. Um, also affiliate programs, and we'll get into that uh, a little bit later. Uh, donations and uh, as I go through some of these and I'm actually writing these it'll be a good advertising for consulting services for doing some of this stuff for other people so that's the concept of how I'm going to actually generate some revenue from this uh, but that's about it um, again uh, the design document is just something that is used to help you go through the mental process of planning out the site and by planning it out and structuring it in, in this way it'll save us a lot of time later on when we we get to actually building the site so thanks a lot